AKK fam. We're here today. We're going to be doing Are You Smarter Than, with, than a Fifth Grader with my father, Abby. <laughs> and my name is Abby, too. Abby Jr., Abby Sr. <laughs> All right, so we're going to start with first grade. He gets the first. Yeah. First question. <laughs> <laughs> the first Thanksgiving was celebrated, celebrated by the Native Americans and what other group of people? The Pilgrims. Yep. All right, second question will be, from which country did Mexico gain its independence in the 19th century? France? Uh, nope. Mexico. No, they're Mexican. How are they going to get independent from Mexico? They weren't independent from Mexico. It could it, it could be the, the United States? Uh, nope. It's Spain. I did say Spain, didn't I say? You said France. <laughs> Fine. Okay, I got one less. All right, your turn. Who invented the light bulb in 1879? Thomas Edison. Yep. All right, next question. Which language is the most widely spoken in South America? Spanish. Yep. Ooh, look at you. Um, your question. Neil Armstrong and... Buzz Aldrin were the first two men in the entire world to do what? Walk on the moon. Yep. Um, you. What are the three branches of the United States government? Executive. Uh, legislative. Mm -hmm. And uh, the leader the House of Representatives. Uh, nope. Oh, nope. uh, no, no. Executive, legislative, and the courts. The uh, law. Uh -uh. Legislative. Executive. The law it has to be the courts. Yeah, the Supreme Court. No. Justice. <laughs> Close. Close. It's judicial. <laughs> I'll give it to you. But yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Um, which war was fought between the North and South regions of the United States? The American Civil War. Yep. Gets the you <laughs> <laughs> Italy, Japan, and Germany alliance was called what during World War II? Italy, Germany. Italy, Japan, and Germany alliance was yeah. called what during World War II? The axis of evil. I don't know now either. Me either. <laughs> Um, Three to two. That's first grade. No, that's second grade now. Oh, right. I thought you said you were the second grade. They don't even second grade. <laughs> <laughs> the second grade I don't know that. Crap. That's what I said. I'm sorry. It's a family family channel. I don't know. Second grade's gonna know what's the deal with the war. They don't Go. know that stuff, bro. Um, next question: What city was the first to be attacked by an atomic bomb? Which city? Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> I don't know. You want Hiroshima? Well, I gotta say, <laughs> that gives me a chance to be the same. Hiroshima. Yep. <laughs> We've tied. What are the first ten amendments to the Constitution called? That's for your father. No, I, I, I already answered his, so he's gonna no, go back to his. No, it's your turn. The ten amendments is called the Bill of Rights. Yep. All right, now we're on third grade. <laughs> What type of feather, beginning with the letter Q, did people write with during the Middle Ages? Mm, I know, it's like, quote, quick, quote, uh, the quick, no, 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 what's it called? <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know, you gotta take it. Quail. Yep. Quail. <laughs> Five to four. All right, next that. question for you, Dad. Julius Caesar was the emperor of what empire? Rome. Yep, Roman. <laughs> 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 All right, Such Abby, what is Rosa Parks most famous for? Mm, I can't, I don't want to say it like that, but <laughs> she's the first one to sit in front of the bus during, uh, mm -hmm. what time? Um... That's yeah. That's what the, the answer is. <laughs> that's what the answer was. Right. You should add that. Thing. <laughs> that's there. It says refusing to give up her seat in the front of the bus. All right, your turn is yeah, the first six. fireworks 
were invented in the seventh century in what country? China. Yep. Damn, you smart. You're smart. <laughs> Name the American president on the half dollar coin who was assassinated in 1963. Abraham Lincoln. Nope. Kennedy. Yep. Are you serious? Stop <laughs> swearing. <laughs> <laughs> what ancient civilization built the Machu? I don't know how to say that word. Michael. You know me? The number one. Machu. Machu Picchu complex in Peru. What was that question? The first part I didn't get it. The first part. What ancient what ancient civilization built the Machu Picchu oh, complex in Peru? This. Yep. Holy cow. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> Someone been history. studying. <laughs> I watch a lot of history. All right, your turn. <laughs> I don't watch <laughs> From whom did the United States buy territory in the Louisi Louisiana purchase? Say it again. From whom did the United States buy territory in the Louisiana Purchase? So who did the United States buy territory from in the Louisiana Purchase? Uh, is it the Indians? No. Nope. <laughs> I don't know. From whom did the United States purchase the Louisiana Purchase? Didn't they borrow that money from France? Yep. Yep. How are you knowing this? <laughs> Your turn. <laughs> Who wrote the national anthem of the United States of America? Something Scott. George, George, George C. Scott. Francis Scott. Francis Scott. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> Francis Scott Key, it says. Francis Scott Key, yeah. Look at the camera. The Your camera. turn. He's you been... Go look at the camera. I'm fine. The Battle of Gettysburg was fought in which civil war? Oh, and what you were at the Civil War. My bad. <laughs> it didn't have it in a different text, that's why. Usually the question. All right, fifth grade. Here we go. Oh, geez. Okay. The what was the name of the last queen of France? Queen Elizabeth. Nope. <laughs> Mary? Bloody Mary? Mary. Mary, yeah. yeah. I'm not doing Yo, he's killing me. <laughs> All right, now it's your dad's turn. The region known as Fertile Crescent is located in present day. Say that again. <laughs> the region known as the Fertile Crescent is known is located in present day. I want to take a wild crap. I don't know. Down it used to be Africa. Nope. What'd you say? Say it again. The region known as the Fertile Crescent is located in present day. Countless? No. no. Middle East. Middle East. I wouldn't know what that means. Okay. You know what that means? Middle East? I don't know what it is. Anyway, I'm not going to right. Middle East. I'm Your turn. <laughs> the modern day of Istanbul was known by what name in the 13th century? Say it again. The modern day city of Istanbul was known by what name in the 13th century? I don't know. Well, they got two answers for that one. Before it was Asia Minor, or is Turkey? What we call Turkey today? It says Constant and Nepal. Constant Yep. Yeah. Well, that's Asia, that's an ancient Minor, but that's okay. I'll let it pass. I didn't get it. All right, your turn. Hey AK fam, thanks for watching a the first part of a two-part series. We answered first through fifth grade history questions, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks. Tell me, tell me, tell me